This is the module that will be installed inside the fuse box inside the car. It's small, it'll tuck away without any trouble at all, and it will be undetectable. This is a command module. This will get uh, installed and plugged into the laptop of the patrol officer's automobile. As an officer, we're trying to shut off a vehicle in a safe area. Well, what we didn't want, uh, have a police chase or have a car just run off and wreck another to another car or hurt some citizens. So we wanted it to be instantaneously. Sometimes it worked, sometimes it didn't. But we do have a direct connection with the RF technology, so it's not going through a satellite and then back down to the automobile. It's going directly from the police officer's automobile to the uh, suspect car. We have it so that it pulses on and off the gas line or the fuel line so that when you activate it, it'll turn it off, turn it back on, turn it off, turn it back on, allowing the car to slow down but not come to a complete stop. Also allowing you to still have a little bit of control over the power steering and brakes. This new technology involves every vehicle, uh, be it a car, truck, bus, 18-wheeler, even a boat. It also requires two officers, sort of a safety check. Uh, currently we have 5, 10, 15, 20 cars out here with the module in each of them and we're able to monitor all of them via the police officer's laptop. So we're going to select the Ford Frontier and we're going to arm it and then on the other laptop we're going to select it it's marked armed and then we're going to stop it and then the status changes from armed to stopped and now the automobile has been disabled yep the engine just died now this is a real game changer it's more cost effective than the existing products available today it's faster response time than going through a satellite a gps system and we know with this new technology we can save lives and protect property at its highest level there's no doubt about it